the R word, recession, has been thrown around a lot lately, even before the two bank failures and interest rate hike. Economist Alan Jin says there's a 60 percent chance of a recession. I think uh, people should be cautious at this point. Uh, there's still a, a stronger possibility then of a recession than not. So um, I think then people should try then to get their financial house in order if possible. Jin says it will be harder and more expensive to borrow money. So mortgage rates are going to be going up, uh, car loans are going to be going up, uh, uh, credit card rates are going to be going up. The Census Bureau says almost 40 percent of Americans use credit cards to pay for necessities. Consumers will feel that pinch. Matt Fico, the CFO of California Coast Credit Union, the longest serving credit union in the county, says that's exactly what they're seeing. We're seeing a drain on savings and a drain on checking accounts and an increase on credit card balances. So that tells us consumers are using the funds that they had saved up for daily expenses, and now they're actually tapping into their credit card balances. FICO says that's a dangerous place to be in when credit is tightening and rates go up. He says now is the time to talk about finances as a family. Be honest about debt, but have the talk even if you're not in debt, like he did with his family. We made a list of all of our expenses for the month and we classified them as necessity and discretionary. So we already know which expenses we can cut that, you know, if, if that time comes. And come up with a plan to pay it off. Tighten in the belt a little bit. Do, do we really need to go out to dinner on Friday night or do we really need to spend some extra stuff, um, you know, for the household? If we don't, don't do it. Focus on doubling up your payment on your credit card bill. But he says you don't have to go it alone. And while it will hurt in the short term, being debt free and having a savings cushion will alleviate stress and prevent financial catastrophe. We'll find the best solution for you to help you get through this situation and avoid getting into those areas where you're having to turn over the keys to your car or, God forbid, walk, you know, turn over the keys to your house. He says you should avoid pulling money out of your retirement because you will pay a late fee and it might not be worth it. Kitty Alvarado, KPBS News.